it's quite fascinating if i may use that word because you fine tune your own style according to the format and the audience like we see you commentate in test cricket and that's a very measured very very um, very a, a quieter version in t20 cricket it's someone who's catering to the masses how did you how did you get that pulse of the audience when say t20 cricket emerged and change your styles according to the format well i think the great thing i can mention that the simple thing and it is great because it's the crowd and it's about the fan base and at the end of the day the fan base is clearly there too for test cricket i'm not saying it's one or the other it, i just think there's the energy because it's faster and it's more furious and it's around um a meet in the studio for you know for want of a bit of take on it, a bit sort of americanized if you like because of cheerleaders and because of the music's been brought in uh, the noise and, and all that sort of stuff uh, it's taken it to a new sort of entertainment whereas test cricket different gear and i've always said to another interviews like this nish is that you're simply changing gears um or if you use the analogy of um bollywood or movies or hollywood um you just have a different genre one's you know quite a serious type detective movie and it's you know you know sensible and serious and and, and you know critiquing or factual or this or getting to a point within that genre as opposed to something that's a bit light but rom-com but up you know but fired up and razz tazzy or an action thriller a bruce willis type yeah rahu movie um that's again a different gear so for me it's about fluctuating with all of them and um people often also ask your position this what do you like the best you know what do you prefer doing and i think really i think energy wise of course t20 because the fans are there it's played at night predominantly so it's more like an entertainment production of you know going to a live theater show whereas test cricket definitely more during the day isn't it? i mean there is now as we know night test cricket pink ball whatever but really predominantly test match cricket is for the red ball white clothing during the daytime and i think that's beautiful and i it, it, i'd be am i a bit old and conservative mish i love that format and it's been around so long and yes they're trying to tweak it and we understand the pros and cons of it but certainly the understanding of trying to get it into the audiences at night but um you know test cricket is just such a great old grand game um, that has all its nuances and all its variations that should be yes there's some marketing type tweaking going on but predominantly it should be left to its own device as opposed to white ball cricket um and what it brings as well so um yeah i mean i do i gravitate more to white ball cricket of course i do it's, you know i tend to do that genre more uh, but that's not to say i don't love test cricket and i do enjoy doing test cricket as well